Good morning to you, mon petit pois, with a sprinkle of icing sugar on top. How are you all? I hope you're well. For me, it is 7.03, pretty early. I'm showered, I'm up, I've done my makeup, I'm just brushing my hair. Whenever I brush my hair, I feel like it sounds like a dry horse's mane. I get so many comments from people, especially when I had like platinum blonde hair, we were kind of like got yellowy lighting, but this is a lot darker than it used to be. And people used to say, your hair, not very funny, but your hair looks so dry. And I'm like, you are right. It is bleached to absolute curry. It is dry. But um, since having some low lights in it, the condition is really improving. Anyway, that's not what we're uh, discussing today. I have two days in London and they're really nice days with really nice things happening. So I thought I would take you along. Let's get ready. I'm staying over. Do you want to see my suitcase? Here she is. This is my little case that I'm taking to London. I really, really love this case. It's um, Samsonite and I love it because it has a little flap for your laptop. I've seen a few more cases do this now, but when I bought this last year, I hadn't seen many. It actually has quite a lot of space in there for other things, for books, magazines, and a phone charger uh, where the wire, I think, is it here, the little wire yes um i just love this and it stretches open if you need a bit more space so i've got my case i've got two dresses because i've got a gala event tonight and then a brunch thing in the morning so yes that is those this is me let's go we are here i've made it to the venue. I haven't said hello to anyone yet, I just shot to the loose. You know me, I'm a loose gal. There's people outside. Lovely loose here. Look who it was unsettling me. It's only Lara. Oh my god. Hello. Honestly, I was just having a good time in the loo. Yeah, cause. I wonder where Louise has gone. Yeah, always in the loo. Where else am I going to be always in a toilet? The event, the event is here. It is here. How lovely is this venue? Look at this. Very pretty. Very lovely. Here's everyone. Stunning. Well, that was a lovely, lovely start to the day. I'm leaving now to try and find a black cab. Am I flashing you? Um, I've been going for lunch with my lovely friend Michelle from P&O Cruises um, because I work with them and also I just really enjoy her company. So that's like a work thing, but it doesn't feel like work, which is quite nice. And we're gonna go somewhere that does the best macaroni cheese. Um, so I'm slightly rushing. <laughs> Like that lady was looking at me like what are you doing um i also have a doctor's appointment in the car you know like a video doctor's appointment i've been feeling um really like not managing my anxiety very well lately um so i got that app you know livy 
um, where you can talk to a GP and this isn't an ad for them by the way um, and yeah I'm hopeful that I can get some help um, hmm I don't really know I need a main road to find a black cab it's a nice area but I've got no sense of where I am at all So I've arrived where I'm having my lunch but my call with the doctor has been pushed back 10 minutes and I had it all lined up so it was like timed perfectly so I'm just going to kind of hover outside because I don't want to go into the restaurant and have the call there. I'm going to have it just out on the street just discussing you know some really personal private information just just here. And this shops we have any why not um so wish me luck with that i'm starting to feel anxious about the call like the call's about anxiety i'm starting to feel anxious about the anxiety call <laughs> i ate the main before i could film it but here's the dessert i have checked into my room here i've just been doing a bit of work on my laptop and amy amy hart who i'm going to the event with tonight I don't even think I've told you about the event. I'm going to a lovely event as Amy's plus one um, has just arrived downstairs. So I will we'll go and get her and then maybe do like a bit of a room tour. But we're getting ready for the night together and it'll be so nice. I really enjoy um, key card. I really enjoy spending time with Amy and yeah, we've always got on really well. Um, but I feel like now she's a mummy too. We have that in common as well. Um, I won't vlog in the corridor. Let's go down and get her. Where are we going? Um, I'll obviously put everyone's links below today. So if you've seen anyone in this vlog, they will be linked below for you. Here she is, she should be just waiting. Here she is. Here she <laughs> The door shut. Right, before we do a room tour, we're going to order some room service. Oh, why is it in that framing? That's not right, is it? This is how it's gonna be. I'm gonna write down what we're going to order and then because Amy's not a melt she's going to do the ringing because that would that's the sort of thing I'd have to practice for okay I'd have to be I like could do. I was never hooked for nine years so I lived on room service so I can do this, this I've got this I've got this thank god for you I will write the list because you don't want to just willy nilly right. do it do you should we just do one chips because we yeah. always order more so uh french fries oh I mean how do you feel about padana pizza or should oh, we just yeah. get margarita okay um just because I'm a comedy genius, I've obviously written diet cock and full cock. Oh, and a Diana ketchup as well, please. Yeah. Thank you. Thanks, babe. Wow, that was, I bow down to you. That was incredibly done. That was, that was confident, it was smooth. Yeah, nice, nice. Oh, yeah. She's all oh, onion salad just before an event. Just what every gal Delish. wants. Delish. So tonight we are off tonight, tonight. We're gonna make it happen. <laughs> so tonight we are off to the LTK Gala. So LTK is the affiliate link program uh, that I use and it's at the Natural History Museum which is very exciting. I think we're gonna learn a lot about affiliate links. Um, we'll link it below. We'll link it below. Um, Basically, for those of you who don't know, affiliate links, I think people think they're quite like sinister and you're trying to catch people out, but it's literally not like, you know like when you go to a hairdresser and they give you like a recommended friend voucher and then you get a tenner off and they get a tenner off. It's literally the same as that. Um, it doesn't cost you any extra to use an affiliate link. It just um, gives the creator like a little tiny, teeny, like penny. Like 7p. Yeah. But um, they add up. Two 7p is 14p. Pounds make pay. Yeah. <laughs> Please make pounds. So yes, we're gonna go and learn about that, meet some brands. Um, so yeah, looking forward to it. Okay, everyone. I want you to prepare yourself for a stunning transformation. Stunning. Stunning. What a stunning shot this is as well. I've really, really nailed the full length here. If you will recall, I wore this when we met last year and forgot the belt, but today, so it's basically a different outfit. You are right, it is basically an entire new outfit. We are in a taxi, I am glittery, and you are feathery. I'm feathery with a little bit of uh, un undisclosed glitter, it's black sequins. We're like a texture sensation. We literally are, <laughs> sensory envelope. We're the baby sensory class. We, we are a walking baby sensory. We literally are. I don't think my camera can do this justice for like, what a spectacle this is. Like, <laughs> we just stood at the side. We just did some lovely photos down there on the steps and 
I feel like I've relaxed now. The initial overwhelm has calmed. And I'm just like taking all this in as just like, I don't know, it's just so like, it's like a little, it's like a feast for the eyes. Just all these like beautiful dresses and lights and lovely building. I am gonna have a moment to talk about bricks, which I know is incredibly boring, but can we just take a moment for the brickwork of this building? Like, number one, did they do this before computers? And number two, like, such intricacy. Like, they didn't need to do that. They could have just done a wall, but they're like, no, let's do columns and let's make every one a different pattern. That would be an amazing idea. I love it. If I was young and slim, this is what I would be looking like. With like sparkles. You look like you look like Barbie. This is maybe the busiest event I've ever been to in my life. I feel like I'm in an episode of Sex and the City, like I'm in New York and I'm a high fashion gal. Speaking of fashion, here's Lara. has been sensational. I've woken up bright and fresh after quite an evening. I just spent the whole evening, I think you probably get this in the vlog, I spent the whole evening just saying wow. Like, when I was, when I was younger, I worked as a receptionist and I used to flick through magazines. Like, I used to read um, all the weekly mags. I used to wait for them to come out. They always came out on a Thursday or a Tuesday. And every lunchtime, I would sit at my desk with my sandwich. I always used to get a brie and cranberry from this like, little bakery place in Liverpool. And I would sit and flick through the magazines and I would always look at people that went to like really glitzy parties in London. I would sit there and think, oh, I wish I could go to those. And last night I had such a moment of being like, I am, I am at that. Like it was at the Natural History Museum. Even when we arrived and we saw the steps and the building all lit up and all the people, like, in, like all the girls in their amazing dresses, and there were some boys as well, but mainly women, um, in like sequins and feathers and lace and like people had gone all out. They weren't just doing like a little dress. Like it was like, it was so beautiful. I don't really know what the word I kept saying like amazing, wow, a spectacle. Like. You know when you see the opening of a film and it's like every colour and lights and wow and just like such a lot visually, that's what it was like arriving. And then going in, it was like that, more like everywhere was like that. They had put so much effort into like dressing the venue, like you didn't really need to dress it much because it was there was like flipping dinosaur skeletons everywhere. But like the flowers, the amount of people that were there, um, it was just incredible and one I really enjoyed like the whole creative artistry event wowness but also and I had that moment of like I'm I'm at this thing I'm at this party this is amazing but also it sort of took me back to the early YouTube days of going to like the YouTube Creator Summits in New York and you'd go to these like massive big venues and see loads of people you knew and all your friends and it was really nice to have just a little taste of like youth again almost um, because I knew I didn't have to like worry about getting home because I was coming here and yeah it was nice to just like 
just be myself for a little while and not be like mummy or fiance or not that I don't love those roles obviously um but yeah it was just good for the soul it was really good um and obviously it really inspired me to try like to know it I think I've tried it a few times but I've never really gotten into affiliate links and stuff because I've always felt like always oh, it's something people want but everyone last night was like but it's helpful because if people are asking you where something's from then you're just providing them a link so I was like yeah, I suppose so. Um, so, what time is it now? Mm, quarter past eight, almost. I need to pack up my case here, um, check out, and then go to this um, breakfast. Even going to this, I've Googled where it is. It's in this really nice, like, brasserie. Um, it looks lovely. Sorry, my arm is, my arm is struggling. Um, and I'm gonna wear that nice dress there. It's a Karen Miller dress. I will link, I will like to know, link it below. Um, and there'll be inspirational, amazing, empowering, uplifting women there and yeah. Sometimes, even though I've been doing this for 15 years now, I do have moments still where I'm like, is this real life? This is amazing. So yes, definitely having one of those. Um, but I'm not gonna stay long, I'm gonna like, go until um, 11 and then I've got to rush back because Pearl's school is having like a Mother's Day afternoon and I can't miss that for the world. So, less chat from me, let's get ready. Hopefully today's portion of the vlog will be a bit less chaotic. I, mean, I can't guarantee it. Um, but we'll go to the Mother's, uh, the Hello thing, then go home um, and what I want to show you at the end of this vlog is, can you see over there? the goodie bag last night now i have lots of thoughts on goodie bags i will share those once i'm home tonight with like jim jams on hair in a bun makeup off that goodie bag just wait just wait here we are pretty much all packed up and all ready to go in this lovely dress look at all the details on it this is so pretty i bought this in the sales in karen millen and it is so lightweight. I think I'm going to be cold in it today. But this is like the perfect summer dress. Or like, I'm going to say it's the perfect spring dress because we're in spring now. But I'm going to be cold in this. And I haven't brought a jacket for it. Um, if I put you here. Just want you to like get a feel. <laughs> Sorry. That's the curtains. Um, look at it. It's so flowy. It's like, a, I think it's silk. Look at it. Oh, yeah. Um, it's on sale at the moment in the Curve range. Um, and also, the last thing, I'm sorry you can't see the top of me, it has pockets. It has pockets. Um, so I am thrilled with this dress. I did have other earrings, but I've just gone for these old classics that everybody has now. Uh, but I love them, they are so light. I'm gonna link these as well. I looked down there and I thought, should I link these as well? I don't wanna become too linky, but these are only from Amazon, they're like a tenner. Um, and then this headband is from um, a small business called Clementine Mint, and she sent me a pink one last year, and it was the only headband that didn't hurt me just here, um, so I bought a few more of her. They are spenny for headbands, but I can wear them all day, and they stay in place and keep my hair back, and um, they don't hurt, like they're the right amount of tension. And I've got a big old head. I'm going to put my camera in my bag now and just use my phone for this morning because the bag that I'm wearing with this is quite small. Um, so you can't fit in. So I'm going to move you to my camera, which uh, my phone, which isn't as lovely as quality as this, but uh, it will do. So I'm going to pop you in here. This is Amy who's doing the photography. Look at all oh, that. That's a big boy, that is. Camera. And we're going to do a little photo shoot just here. So if I pop you here... Ta-da! Oh no, but now you're not in it. Now you don't, now you don't get Amy working her magic. There we go. What's stunning? <laughs> What's stunning
photo like can can you come and live with me because i never take a photo that nice <laughs> And I've come downstairs to use the toilets. I you know how I like a good toilet. I think I found ultimate toilet. I'm actually going to do you a toilet tour. So you come in this door. Hello. Hello. You're greeted with this little pamper zone area. Lovely big mirror here. This is amazing. And then toilets in there. And then this is where you wash your hands. Look at this. Stop it. Toilets in London to Pink Kitchen in Northampton. I am home. I am dressed. I have freshened myself up a bit. It's about one o'clock and I'm just getting myself a drink ready because Pearl's Primary School are having like a little cute thing for Mother's Day. I think they've done some songs and stuff like that. So just getting myself a drink. Um, I was just on Instagram saying I have taken 772 pictures or video clips from the last, like since yesterday morning. Um, so I've got quite a lot to do tonight in terms of deciding what's going to go up tonight and what needs to go into reels and TikToks and shorts and all that good stuff. Um, I'm noticing on my camera that the framing of the videos keep changing so it feels like you're not as wide as you should be. Um, Normally it goes like here, but you're only here. I do keep changing it on this camera when I start filming, but it's just not having any of it. So this vlog will be a mess, but you know, no change there from the last 10 years of content. Not even 10, 14, 14 years of YouTube content. Um, right, I, my brain is like, so full it's so full. I, I feel like I've had so many experiences this last few days that my brain is so full to capacity I don't really have a lot of space for anything else um but yes uh let's go to listen to some sweet sweet songs um obviously I don't ever film at school but I might like film my lap whilst they sing their songs or something like that let's go that is amazing can I show the front of it as well look at that and you sewed that yourself that is so good and some flowers as well hello hello it's a little bit later actually a couple of days later but life just took over and I knew I would have a little spot this evening to chat to you I want to show you the goodie bag I also want to apologize I think I mentioned it in some clips a couple of days ago the framing on this I don't know what happened with my camera hopefully I fixed it now because you should be as wide as you should be as it were um, but that's gonna really annoy me. I don't know whether I will try in the edit. If everything looked a bit squashed, it's because I've tried to fix it, or I'll just leave it with like margins down the side. You live and learn, she says, having done this job <laughs> a really long time. Right, let me show you the goodie bags. I normally don't make a fuss of goodie bags because I, well, mainly because I don't want to look like a bell end, being like, oh, look what I got, um, because I appreciate that it's a luxury and not everybody gets one, so I try not to. However, I think that it's interesting sometimes, and I also think that since you came to the events with me, you might like to kind of come to the, have the full circle experience. So, we will start backwards. The last event I went to was the Hello Magazine um, breakfast, and they gave us a little goodie bag here. They gave us a tote, and I will show you what's in it. Wouldn't be a Hello Magazine event without a Hello Magazine in your goodie bag. This is really cute. This is from Not On The High Street who were at the event and it is a Dear Mum From You To Me journal of a lifetime. And I think it's one of those where you fill in each page, they have questions like, describe some of the favorite outfits you wore as a young woman. Describe the occasion when you first met my father's parents. Did I have any nicknames or pet names before I was born or when I was young? Like. I think these are so lovely. My grandma and granddad both did a similar one of these for me. Um, obviously before they passed, they didn't, they didn't write it from the grave. Um, they're not even in a grave. We still haven't scattered them. I think I've mentioned that before. Like, we really need to get going with that. Um, lovely gift. Thank you very much. Not on the high street. I shall enjoy writing that soon. I meant to say there, 
grandma and granddad both wrote me one and it's something I treasure and really love but I got I got weird I also have some supplements because there was a supplement brand there and some pro plus fizzes I don't know if you remember these from your younger I say from your younger days you're probably a lot younger than me um I used to have a lot of pro plus at university um it's basically what got me through my degree um but I haven't had it for years and years because um I don't really know why lovely and then a deliciously Ella bar because Ella deliciously Ella herself was on the panel of speakers so we've got an apple and made some oat book. I also took the little menu off my table place because I save all these little things in a scrapbook um, that I know that I'll look at when I'm old and grey and treasure all these lovely memories. Right, we are moving on to now the Like to Know It Gala goodie bags. Bags. Um, because, wow. So the first one is just this great big Like to Know It bag. And inside... Hang on, let's do that one last. We have a like to know it pop socket. I'm going to give this to Darcy because she's managed to break her pop socket. Has anyone watching broken a pop socket? I'm so rough with mine, never broken it, but she has managed to, <laughs> which is impressive. Um, oh, there's my little Huggies earrings that I've just chucked in the bottom of the bag there. Okay, good. Glad we looked through there. We have this little um like velveteen bag here and other reasons established 2020-12 and it's like weighty it's jewelry but this is so my kind of thing i know that this won't be to everyone's taste but this is very my taste i love a novelty earring how gorgeous are these for the summer think summer beach holiday think strappy dress think tan think hair down i love these or i might also wear these if i was ever doing like an ariel or a moana disney bound if it, but it's that glass it's really heavy maybe it's glass or resin but really nice a beauty edit brow setter okay the next thing i'm going to show you it's going to be divisive some of you will feel my joy some of you will just think i'm a massive melt and i'm okay with that i know who i am I'm a basic hun, and I'm proud of it. It's a Stanley Cup. It's a freaking Stanley Cup. Now, I've been drinking out of these sorts of cups. This is not the Stanley dupe since last year. I looked at when I ordered my first pink one with the handle, and it was April last year. I continue to use them. They've stood the test of time. I love them. But I've never bought myself an actual Stanley Cup because... I, I mean, I'm glad I've got this, but I do think that they're very expensive for a cup. I think the last time I checked, they were like £50, which, even if you're drinking out of it every day, I still i am not sure £50, because I've been drinking out of my Amazon dupe every day, and I didn't pay £50, but I think I paid about tenner for it. I will leave both linked below for you. I will leave Sandy's, because, you know, maybe the like designer names are important to you i don't judge you if that's important to you we've all got different things that's important and maybe after using this for a year or however long i'll be like oh yes this is far superior to the other one who knows or it does have like um a silicon grippy on the, on the handle and my other handle doesn't have this but yeah i was so i was so pleased i was like irrationally pleased for a cup the other bag that they gave us at the end of the Like to Know It gala, and can I just say, I wasn't even invited. I was Amy Hart's plus one, so I wasn't really expecting a goodie bag. I thought they would just give her a goodie bag. No, no, they were very generous. They gave everybody a goodie bag, and it is this from Space NK. Sorry the lighting is a little bit yellowy. I don't really know. Shall I see if I can fix it? Is it bothering anyone or is it cosy? We'll just leave it. It's cosy. Um, let's, let's go through everything in here. I'll show you the bits and pieces and then if you could comment below if you've used it, what you thought of it, any like hacks, tips and tricks for like how to get the best out of the product, I'm all ears because a lot of these are new to me. So the first one here is Chris Appleton and Colour Wow Money Mask for Super Glossy Expensive Looking Hair and I have heard amazing things about this so if you have used this and loved it, let me know. 
two products here that I'm not familiar with is the Summer Friday's Jet Lag Mask and the Skin Nova Radiance Primer. Positive Light Liquid Luminizer by Rare Beauty. What is this? What actually is it? Sometimes I find the titles of things so hard. A silky second skin liquid highlighter. Yeah, okay. I love a highlighter. At the moment I'm obsessed with the iconic um, in blush. Oh wow, she looks nice. Oh, if it's a pipette, I'm going to be excited because I do like, mmm. Ah, oh, so close, although, that is a big doe foot applicator, and I do like big doe foot applicators. Yeah, that is still nice. It's not a pipette, but I do enjoy this, and I do enjoy the size of the doe foot. I need to speed up because I'm waffling on too long for each product. This is not meant to be a whole video. Let's be quickly, quickly, quick. Okay, um, Hair by Sam McKnight Light Cleanse Hair and Scalp Shampoo. That will be very handy. I tell you who is very excited about this goodie bag, Darcy. Uh, and then the conditioner to go with that, she will be pinching a lot of this. I do research the things she uses. She doesn't use drunk, uh, drunk, junk elephant with the retinol in. I am careful with the stuff she's on her skin before I get the comments. Um, Cordially um, Beauty Elixir. Now, I remember this being a big deal. Someone tell me what I do with it, please. I would appreciate that because I don't fully know. Ooh, Opalex number seven, bonding oil. Um, sculpted by Amy, Beauty Balm, Lips and Skin Nourishment. Very excited, especially as we met the Amy from Sculpted by Amy. I hope I vlogged that. If not, it will be on the grid. The Sol de Janeiro number 62. Darcy will have this in an instant. Cosas, Cosas. Um, weightless lip colour, nourishing satin lipstick. I'm excited to try that um, in warm rosy pink. That's very much my colour, warm rosy pink. And then Paula's Choice Exfoliate Skin Perfecting Liquid ex Exfoliant. That sounds nice as well. Um, and then the bag, which I should keep. I keep so many bags. I do use them for lots of things, but I'm a sucker for a nice bag. And then last of all, if we're going backwards in events, um, Emily Norris had her book launch and I have her book here. I'll actually link that below for you if you would like to buy Emily's book. Um, it's a little book full of all sorts of like really useful like tips and hacks and great little nuggets of things to help you in your day-to-day -day life. And it's not just for mums as well. So that is a lovely book there too. If you have watched all the way to the end of this video, thank you so much. Leave a comment saying, um, OMG the goodie bag or something like that and I will know that you've watched all the way to this point and you are a dedicated oldie but goldie 99 glitter points to you. Um, I still have to edit my controversial motherhood um, topics. I, I'll, I'll probably upload them after this video. I, I basically was just too scared to upload them. I got, I don't know that I, I don't know that I was my best self in the video. Like when I was reading the questions and like thinking of my answers I was like yeah that is my opinion and I'm not afraid to share it and then when I turned the camera on I just became like very apologetic so I don't I haven't even tried to edit it yet but maybe I can edit out a lot of like the um like ooh sorry kind of vibe because I don't want to be too sorry like they are my opinions and I'm not afraid of my opinions um <laughs> I'm just afraid of what people think of my opinions so yes if I have a strong moment I will edit and upload that if not, it will just be this video, but as I film this, I'm getting ready to go and do something so out of the ordinary for me. Um, it's not out of the ordinary for anyone else, but it is out of the ordinary for me, and that is go away without the children or Liam and go away with a friend for a few days. I can't tell you how much I don't do girls' trips away. Um, there is a couple of reasons behind it that I will explain in the video that I think... I will make of that trip. Um, I don't know what that will look like yet, but it's in my mind to take my camera, so we will see. I hope you've enjoyed this video, and I'm sending you all lots and lots of love. Thanks for watching. Bye!